Welcome to YQ Academy JavaScript Interview Questions and Answers. 1. What you mean by hoisting in JS? The concept of hoisting stands for uplifting the variable and functions on the top of their scope before the code execution takes place. In the JavaScript mechanism, no matter wherever the functions are declared, they are taken on the topmost position, immaterial of their scope, global or local. 2. Name a few built in methods. Number methods, constructor, toe exponential, toe fixed. Boolean methods, toe source, toe string, value off. Date methods, date, get full year, get hours. Math methods, abs, exp, log. 3. How can you submit a form using JS? To submit a simple form, the below code will work. Document, form 0, submit. 4. What do you mean by control flow and error handling in JS? In JavaScript, Control flow stands for a process that ensures that an appropriate order is followed to execute statements in a script. It also ensures that one must read not only the entire code, but also check the program structure and how that structure affects execution. Whereas, error handling in JS means catching an error using try. Catch initially, the code try functions in a way that if the code is error-free, catch function will be ignored. But in case any error is found, Try execution is paused, and controller begins. 5. What is DOM in JS? DOM stands for Document Object Modeling, which is language allowing dynamic accessing and modifying the content in any document. Level of abstractions DOM has in JavaScript. DOM Level 1, DOM Level 2, DOM Level 3, Scalable Vector Graphics, Mathematical Markup Language, 6. What is BOM in JS? BOM stands for Browser Object Model a more extensive representation of elements provided by the browser-like document, location, history, and frames exposed to JavaScript. DOM is a part of BOM, and to access the document, one can use code document or window document. 7. What is a JavaScript string? Whenever we want to store or manipulate text, we use JavaScript strings. We need JavaScript string methods to work with strings. 8. In JavaScript, what does an anonymous function do? The function that has no defined name is called an anonymous function in JavaScript. One can easily use this function by replacing expression. This anonymous function can also be assigned to a variable. Further, this function can also be moved as an argument to a different function. 9. In JavaScript, how can you validate null or empty value? It is essential to check the condition that any user has added any value in the given field. The below code will help. Slash slash if the length is zero, then imitate helper message. Function required in PuTTX. If in PuTTX, value, length equal equal zero, alert message, return false, return true, 10. Please list some of the design patterns in JS. Whenever somebody wants to reuse solutions for regularly occurring problems in software designing, design patterns will solve the purpose. Latest design patterns in JS are module design pattern, Revealing module pattern, prototype design pattern, revealing prototype pattern, observer design pattern, singleton, 11. To find the usage of set object in JS. Set objects in JavaScript are the source to store elements having unique values, including both primitive as well as the object reference values. 12. Deep VS, shallow object copying in JavaScript. 1. Deep coping. This means that all the values of the existing slash original variables are copied to a new variable and thus disconnected from the existing variables. 2. Shallow coping. When commanded for shallow coping, not all the existing variables are disconnected, and some of the values or subvalues are still connected to the original. 13. How to formulate a cookie using JS. A cookie is a set of data saved on the computer and accessed by the browser. Step to create a JavaScript cookie. Document, cookie equal cookie name equal John, expires equal date, 14. Once a cookie is created, how to read a cookie using JS. In the case of JavaScript, cookies can be read as var x equal document cookie, 15. In HTML, how many ways are there to involve JS? There are three ways to include JavaScript in HTML. 1. Sandwich the JavaScript code by defining a pair less than script greater than less than slash script greater than tags of HTML. 2. Create an external JavaScript file to define less than script tsrc equals script. 
HTS greater than less than slash script greater than in HTML, 3. Directly code the JavaScript into HTML element, 16. Differentiate cookies, local storage, and session storage. Cookies, cookies are those small sets of data consisting of a name and value stored by a web browser. JavaScript facilitates cookie creation, retrieval, and deletion via an intuitive interface. Local storage, a unique type of web storage, which allows websites to store and obtain data in the browser without any specified expiry date. Session storage saves data only for one session, and as soon as the tab is closed, it's deleted. 17. What is the major difference between equal equal and equal 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 operators? It is one of the favorite JavaScript interview questions asked by an interviewer for the profile of web developers. The major difference between equal equal operator and equal 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 operator is that equal 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 considers type of variables whereas equal equal makes corrections based on the values of variables. Equal 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 is strictly an equality operator. 18. Define isnin in JS. Isnin is a function used for defining a function true if in case the argument is not a number. 19. How to remove the focus from a specified object in JS. Blur function can be highly useful in removing the focus. 20. How to enable strict mode in JS. In JavaScript programming language, when strict mode is enabled, it adds compulsions. This function is used for solving some of the mistakes hindering the efficiency of the JavaScript engines. The code is functions ma function, use strict, bar v equals strict mode enabled. This is the end of our JavaScript interview questions. We hope you enjoyed learning with YQ Academy. Until next time, goodbye.